What's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to new video guys. So right now we are actually gonna go pick up the 335 from the body shop. A few weeks ago we dropped it off to get the quarter panel fixed. Um, I never really recorded anything because I was just dropping it off. But today it is finished so we are about to go pick it up right now. Can't wait to show you guys what it looks like. I haven't even seen it myself so we're gonna go check it out. Hopefully everything's all good. I had them repair the main quarter panel damage and then on the other side uh, there was some really bad fender rolling done and it just looked really bad so I'm, I had them fix that as well and then I also had them put on an M Sport bumper guys so we actually installed an M Sport bumper as well um, so we got the M Sport rear bumper now it's coming together slowly guys we even have the wrap over here as well um, so <laughs> literally tomorrow we're gonna go ahead and start wrapping it I don't know if it'll be this video or next video uh, but we are gonna go pick it up real quick All right guys, so the car is right here. So they ended up replacing, or they ended up fixing the quarter panel. Um, they put Bondo on it and everything. Um, looks pretty good. They ended up fixing the door as well. And it looks pretty good as well. We might have to do a little bit extra sanding in little spots for the wrap. Um, but for the most part, considering how it was before, it looks pretty, pretty good. And then on this side, um, they went ahead and fixed uh, this part right here. Um, so it's all looking good now. Um, let's go ahead and drive it real quick. All right guys, so we got the car back. Um, it looks really good, very happy with this side. Um, I'll show you guys the other side more as well. So if you look over here, um, it kind of looks like it's a little bit off, um, at least the bumper and the fitment wise. It's not like perfect, which is a little bit annoying. So I'm gonna see if I can mess with that later um, and fix that. And then he ended up fixing this, and I'm not sure why he fixed this because I have a new one that I asked him to replace, but uh, I guess he just decided to to fix this one for whatever reason. So I'm gonna have to take that off, um, put on the new one. But for the most part, it looks pretty good. The interior is quite a mess though. Um, there's a ton of dust everywhere. So I'm gonna go ahead, clean this thing out, wipe it all down because it is just super, super dusty like, like I showed you guys. So um, dust everywhere. So let's go ahead and start cleaning this thing out. All right guys, also while we're cleaning this out, I ended up picking up a new seat, a new driver's seat, because for whatever reason, I didn't notice that this has been repaired on the seat that I have in here and the bolsters are like super firm and it won't go down. So I think the seat is like broken. Um, so I ended up copying a new seat. So we're gonna go ahead and throw this in right now as well while we're cleaning this up. Um, but yeah guys, we have it here. It's come together really good. Um, the reason why I had him do this is because the fitment on this one was really, really bad. Not as bad as the other side, obviously, but uh, just it was a fender roll that was really bad. Let's go ahead and start cleaning this thing out. It is so dusty. And then tomorrow, I think we might start wrapping it. All right guys, so I just wiped this down just to try to get most of the dirt off, but I think I'm gonna actually have to like give it a proper wash. In here, I wiped down mostly everything, so it's a lot cleaner in here now. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and back this out a little bit and reverse the car so I can actually take out this seat. It's really easy to do because I've done it in other videos as you guys have seen, but uh, this angle is kind of a little bit bad. So I'm gonna flip it around, switch out the seat, and then like pressure wash the car. And sorry about the kids like screaming out there. They're pretty loud. Hopefully it's not picking up too much. Um, but yeah, it's coming together guys. Very excited about this. Ready to start wrapping it. And I'm excited to announce the wrap. Hopefully the next video, um, we're gonna go ahead and see what happens though. So let me go ahead, flip it around.
All right guys, so this is the old one right here. It was repaired before and this bolster will not go down. So it's kind of frustrating. This side is good. It has a little bit more wear. Well, not a little bit more. This one's definitely in better condition. But real quick, before I throw it in there, I'm gonna clean it up, make it look really, really nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and put you guys on time lapse. Alright guys, so this seat actually feels way, way better. Uh, like I said, the other one, the bolsters were super like firm and like super like tight and it just hurt when you were driving to be honest and it wouldn't go down at all. So I'm glad I picked up this seat. I think I got it for like 300 bucks. It was a little bit pricey, but uh, for just one seat, considering that I got the rest of the interior for like 500 bucks, this is it, I guess. So in total, I think I spent like 800 bucks on the full brown interior. It looks really nice, very happy with how it is. So now that we fixed this part, I think what we're gonna do, we might just give this a car wash and then end the video off right there because I don't know what else I can really do right now. Hopefully, hopefully though, I'm gonna head over to Erlan's house tomorrow and start recording, wrapping the car. So it's gonna be very exciting. I'm very excited to actually start wrapping this thing and hopefully start driving this thing. But for the time being, I'm gonna go ahead, push this car, and then I'll catch you guys after that. All right guys, we just finished washing the car. It started to get pretty dark outside, but uh, it cleaned up really nice. Very happy with how it turned out. Um, hopefully it's picking it up nicely on camera, but it's all nice and clean. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and end off the video right here. So yeah guys, uh, we finally got the 335 body work done. Oh my gosh, I've been waiting so long for this moment, guys. You don't even understand. Work and just life has gotten in the way of me being able to record a lot of the time, but it is ready. Finally finished. Well, not finally finished, but uh, we're gonna start wrapping it here soon. Um, I mean, like the body work is all done and it's starting to actually look like a decently nice car. So once we get the wrap done, it's gonna be really nice. Probably gonna get a different set of wheels actually because um, the color wrap, I'm gonna give you guys a little bit of a hint. The color wrap, I personally don't think goes with the silver wheels, but uh, I guess we'll go, we're gonna go ahead and find out because I'm gonna wrap the car before I change the wheels. So yeah, stay tuned for that guys. We got lots of content coming for this car now. Finally, finally ready to actually do some real mods to this thing. So stay tuned for that guys. But yeah, with that being said, make sure to go check me out on Instagram. I'll go ahead and throw up my Instagram right over here. Make sure to like and subscribe while you guys are at it. I would really, really appreciate that. And with that being said guys, remember stay safe, stay happy, and stay in that project car. I will catch you guys later. Oh, no.